One of the biggest differences between Scribble Knots and Scribble Knots on the Wii U is we've taken our content out of these little levels and put it into this big open connected world. And so you have this big open connected world on your TV screen and you use the controller to identify the different objectives. Because the game is available on the TV screen and everybody can see what's going on, we really wanted to play up and increase the audience participation element of the game. We're actually allowing the participants to get just grab Wii remotes and jump into the game by you know, assuming control of, of different characters and creatures in the game and using them to solve puzzles. Fifth Cell Scribble Knots has always been about imagination. It's about allowing the user to think of any object that exists in the world and bringing that object to life. In Scribble Knots Unlimited, we wanted to take it from our imagination to the user's imagination, where they can create any object that they can think of, whether it exists or not. We call the object editor. So one example of a scenario in, in Scribble Knots Unlimited is you encounter the chef in the game world, and the chef's looking for truffles. So you could be boring, and you could spawn like a dog or something to sniff out the truffles. Or you could do something interesting, like living pig-like monster truck, and that would find the truffle as well. And we also introduced a new adjective keyboard, so you can basically write adjectives and apply them directly to objects in the game world. Previous Scribble Knots, Maxwell was this mysterious figure that we didn't know very much about. We just knew that he needed these objects called starites. We never knew why, we never knew where he came from. In Scribble Knots Unlimited, we're gonna learn about why he sets out on these quests to pursue these, you know, these starites. <laughs> 